All right, today we're going to talk about how to solve vertical angles using algebra. So you know, for instance, that when two angles when two lines intersect, here's one line, and here's the other line. At their point of intersection, intersection is where they cross right here. We know that the opposite angles, or the vertical angles, the ones on opposite sides, so this one is on the opposite side of this one, on the opposite sides of this little X here, if they're on opposite sides, they're called vertical angles and they're congruent. They're the same. So we know that the blue one, that blue angle up there, this blue angle right here, is going to equal this orange angle over here. They're going to be equal. So I'm going to put an equal sign in the middle to remind us that the blue one equals the orange one. The blue one equals 2x plus 68. 2x plus 68. And the orange one equals, right here, 5x plus 119. 5x plus 119. And in the long run, what we need to do now is get all the, we always need to get the x by itself. So let's try to get this x by itself by subtracting 68. We're going to subtract 68 from both sides. The 2x just comes down. The 68's cancel because 68 minus 68 is 0. It's going to equal 5x. And it's going to equal 9 minus 8 is 1. We have to carry the 1 from here. 11 minus 6 is 5. And then we have to subtract. We have to get rid of all, we have to get all the x's over here to this side. So we subtract 5x. We subtract 5x. It's going to equal negative 3x is going to equal 51. So I'm going to rewrite it up here. Negative 3x equals 51 divide by negative 3 divide by negative 3 and x is going to equal let's do it in the calculator 51 divided by 3 or I'm sorry divided by negative 3 is going to equal negative 17 and so right here x is going to equal negative 17 and that is how you solve for x when you need to find vertical angles